Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to make a soup. It's going to be a plantain soup. Very delicious and very easy to make. If you want to see this video, stay tuned. For the ingredients, I'm going to use some of these fresh vegetables. I have in here culantro or recao. I also have cilantro. I'm going to show you how it looks. You can find them as culantro. Some people call them recao. And I'm going to add this because we're going to make like a stock, okay, chicken stock. So I'm going to add this much. And of course, we're going to wash real good these vegetables and I'm also going to add some cilantro I'm not going to add the whole thing I'm just going to get like a handful of this like this we're going to add peppers and we're going to add fresh garlic in this pot I have 10 cups of water and we're going to add all these vegetables in there you have the um I'm gonna let them boil and then I'm going to remove them out. Or you can just go ahead and blend it or you can use sofrito. I'm just gonna get a piece and I'm gonna add them in there. I have the uh, chicken flavor bouillon. I'm gonna add one tablespoon. If you have the bouillon, you can add one cube in there. Or you can do this with the uh, beef, you can do it with ham, whatever flavor you have. Also, you can add some meat if you like. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and cut the plantains. The plantains are the green one. We're gonna remove the skin and then we're gonna cut it in small pieces. Now I'm going to cut the onions. Now I'm going to use um Fresh garlic, that's very important. You can use garlic paste. I'm going to use this thing in here, but you can put it in a food processor. You can smash it with a smash thing. So I'm adding two, three, four, five. So honestly, the amount depends on your taste. We're gonna smash it down and then we're gonna put it on the side. Okay, in the saucepan, I'm gonna add a little bit of oil, and you're gonna put your heat in medium. You're gonna add your plantain, and you're gonna um, fry them 
a medium heat until they are soft. In here, I'm just gonna go ahead and remove the vegetables. Like I say, you can remove them, or you can blend it up, you can do whatever you want. And in here, I'm just going to um, stir. As you see, when you sit them, when they are cooked, and then we, we're gonna add the uh, garlic. I'm just gonna go ahead and add a little bit more oil. I'm going to add more water. I add like a three more cups. And then I'm going to go ahead and add the uh, garlic. We're going to saute this for a couple of minutes and medium high and medium heat. And now with a potato masher, I'm gonna mash it now. You can use your food processor. You can use this thing in here, just be careful, okay? Or we're gonna have some chunk, we're gonna leave some chunk. Or you can use the same thing you use for the, um, in the Montero, we call the Montero. I don't know how to say that in English, but I'm going to show you. You can use one of those three things just to mash them now. And remember, you want uh, some pieces. So um, don't mash it too, too soft. I'm gonna show you. You can use this too. Like if you do a mofongo, the same thing. That's the same thing you can do in here. After you mash them down, you can, you're gonna add them to the soup. And remember, when you add them, remember, add them quickly, stir, and you're gonna continue, right, doing this. Now I'm gonna add like a one teaspoon of parsley, one teaspoon, one teaspoon of oregano, a little bit, half teaspoon to one teaspoon of cumin, and now I'm going to make some bolitas or balls plantain balls and we're gonna shred it that's optional if you want to do it if you don't want to do it you don't have to do it you're gonna use you see the shredded half too far we're gonna use this small one and be careful don't shred your fingers Now I'm gonna add just a little bit of salt and we're gonna form some balls, little balls, okay? Um, it's important you wet your hands. Okay, I wet my hands and then I'm gonna do small balls like this, okay? And we're gonna add them in there. That's very delicious, try it please. We're gonna continue doing that, little balls. You can do one plantain, I just, I just see one plantain, but you can do two, but I, I love them. We fight out of those little bowls. I'm gonna taste it for salt, and definitely need more salt. I forgot to mention you can add some pepper. I forgot to add some black pepper. You can add some black pepper. I'm gonna add one envelope of sazon con culantro y achote. And I'm gonna go ahead and add one 
tablespoon or one teaspoon of the uh, chicken flavor. After that, you're gonna taste it again, and if you think that soup needs more salt, you can add more salt. So always check, always taste it, and adjust the flavor to your taste and your family's. I'm gonna go ahead and get this red pepper and cut it in small pieces. And I also gonna have just a little bit of the culantro and a little bit of the cilantro and cut it in small pieces and add them in there. Practically, the soup is done. I'm just gonna tear it off. I'm gonna add the, those things in here. I'm gonna tear it up, I'm gonna cover it, and then I'm gonna let it sit for 10 minutes. And it's ready to serve. You can serve this with white rice, with avocado, or a piece of bread, or just the way it is. This is very delicious. So please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to share in your social media, share with your family and friends, and give me a thumbs up if you like this video. And I also want to remind you, my videos is also in Spanish. You can share the Spanish version to your Hispanic or Latino friends. So now I'm going to go ahead and make some platanos, fried plantains, and ready to eat.